Got a big problem on your hands? Hire a big solution. At the Sadaris insurrection, the Legion outmaneuvered, outfought, and outlasted the rebel upstarts, restoring order to a chaotic world. No Legionnaire will ever forget their steadfast tradition of fighting to the last. At the massacre of Kandaran, Legionnaires sold their lives dearly while evacuating the royal family. Royal families clear of power. Adept in any environment, Legionnaires have a long history of bringing the battle to the enemy, wherever and whoever they may be. Need an edge on your industry competitors? Legionnaires are experts in industrial sabotage and ready to put your competitors' profit margins six feet under. Pull up! Pull up! No mission too desperate, no job too dirty. Keep your hands clean and call in the Legionnaires. Hi guys, welcome to Black, uh, Black Warrior 4 Black Knight. Uh, this is actually truthfully a game I have never played. Uh, I have never completed this, never done it. It's just, I never owned it, so I never did it, and now I have it, so... It's going to be a blind run, I guess. So we're doing this on regular difficulty, uh, which is uh, basically as easy, regular, hard, and very hard. So I'm going to do it on regular, even though uh, there's also a bunch of cheat things, obviously, I have off uh, as well. So uh, let's get started. This is Colonel Lawhorn to all Legion personnel. The Carvati Corporation has contracted us to take care of some pirate raids on a remote mining world near the Capellan border of the Federated Commonwealth. It looks like the corporation set up shop without any significant security survey. Now they're paying for it. We're on an open-ended contract to secure the Corvati facilities and eliminate the pirate threat. Check your mission overviews for more detailed instructions. Yeah, this one doesn't actually seem to have the movies either. We don't know the size or disposition of the pirate threat, and we're not taking anything for granted. All light and medium lances will begin immediate recon of Corvati mining facilities. Your tactical officers will keep you updated as we get a better picture of what we're up against. Stay sharp. Black Six, out. Alright, well, to the next lab first, and uh, I'll just show you what I start with, just so you get an idea, and then I'll do my modifications after off-screen. Uh, so we start off with the Cougar, which is a fairly decently speed mech. Uh, it's not 96 kph, not too bad. I could probably also get an upgrade for it if I'd like to remove some stuff on it as well. Give it a bit more of, a, of speed. Uh, so it's, it's pretty nice, it's probably the one I'll be using. Sure. Um, we also have the Osiris, top speed of 130. Uh, also jump jets. I'm probably going to remove the jump jets on all these mechs because AI doesn't use it. I'm fairly certain of that. And uh, we also have the Raven, which is a very utility mech. It comes with like the Narc and a lot of small lasers and stuff. Also for weapons, I only start with like LRM20 and a bunch of clan technology stuff, which a lot of this, these mechs actually have clan technology. but. Uh, with respect to the Raven, I'm actually probably not going to use this guy uh, right now, so unless uh, one of my awesome lance mates uh, decides to break their mech. And the last one we got is the Uller, uh, which is also a very fast mech, so I'm probably going to give my uh, allies fast mechs they can uh, uh, stick with me, and then, uh, yeah, so we'll see how I set this up. So, uh, yeah, so that's it. Okay, so I finished customizing, and I've kept the loadouts relatively the same, I just have two large lasers. We have some neat looking Black Legion camo, so uh, I guess uh, I'm going to run that one. Uh, nobody's going to run the uh, Raven because I think the Raven's a piece of junk, so uh, I think we're good to go. Let's get going. Your lands proceed to designated coordinates and report on condition of mining facility. The last transmission received was two days ago. Hostile presence is likely. Check all nav points and report any hostile contacts as priority traffic. Looks like Striker Lance gets to clean up a messy little corporate write-off. Stow it, Radcliffe. The sooner we run these points, the sooner I can get back to fleecing you at cards. Better work than facing down clamors or Fedcon regulars any day. My point, dear Isabel, the corporation gives no thought to the miners. They are acceptable write-offs in determining just how secure a planetoid is. 
Their precious facilities, on the other hand. You can both write off your next sleep cycles if you don't give a ready report and clear the comm. Striker 2, ready for up. Over. Striker 3, ready for up. Over. Mandrel, this is Striker lead. We report ready up. Roger, Striker 1. Up time is 0615. Mandrel out. Contact, 800 meters. Looks like light vehicles only. Looks like we've got company. Roger, let's take these guys out before they make us. They're probably gonna make us because I just, uh... Ah, uh, missing! Okay, let's let's try and take these guys out. Those tanks aren't corporate issue. It looks like we've found our marauders. Have to go snipe them all out. Mandrel, this is Striker 1. Engaging pirate tanks. Vicinity, Nav Alpha. Roger, Striker 1. Continue through nav points and report all contacts. Mandrel out. Striker lead, we just detected an encrypted burst transmission from your vicinity. Report status. They made us, sir. Yeah. Target we destroyed. didn't kill them fast Warning. enough. Heat exceeding recommended level. I'm not sure what that actually does. I haven't played this yet, but I know that if you don't kill them fast enough, that actually happens. Uh, and it was my fault I missed a whole bunch. But uh, one thing I do like about this game already is... Nav point alpha. The, the main character in this game has a really sexy voice. Look, listen to this. Close up and form on me. Copy. Roger, lead. I like that so much more than Ian Jassari of uh, the the first uh, the Mech Warrior 4. I always thought the Mercs one was a really good voice, but I really like the voice in this one too. Uh, this one's this one's pretty good. But yeah, here we are. And the reason I never played this game before is uh, I bought Mech Warrior 4 and the Mech Warrior 4 Mercs, and that was it. I never bought this one. I never saw it, and I. I don't know, I, I didn't, don't think I knew it existed. And so I got it recently and I'm like, shit, I gotta play this. And, uh, well, I knew it existed. Mandrel, this is Striker 1. We have enemy mechs vicinity Nav Beta. Roger, Striker 1. Proceed to the mining facility marked Nav Gamma. Engage and destroy all hostile units. Attack my target. Roger. Roger. So these guys fortunately can hit pretty hard. Unfortunately, I keep... that. My arms are kind of like in a weird place, so... But, you know, I, I, this is a pretty easy mission, and I did buff up the default armor, so it's okay. Well, we're going to keep mobile, though. We're not too close, because the same mechanics do apply here. If, uh, if something cores, like, really close to you, you take damage from it. I was just showing you what, what would happen if you went too close to something. Take out designated target. Roger. Copy. I do have a bit of a sniper configuration on this mech, so... That's why I'm kind of trying to send my guys up there. It is it is very early on mission. They have Osiris's. These are, these are shit mechs. Well, everything is a shit mech in this right now because it's really early on. Apparently my lance mates are not very good at listening to me. Take out designated target. Copy. Roger. We just want to take out a CT and that's it. Center torso, whatever. It's actually a cool game so far. I, I'm, I'm enjoying it. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know what to expect. It's it's going to be good times. A mech warrior game I haven't played. I've played most of them. Not, not really the old ones, but this one, nope, just never touched it. So. Target terminated. Target destroyed. We seem to have a very multicultural team going here. Like ones like they have like really foreign accents. Like Raja, kind of kind of crap going on. You know my my mech warrior online like instincts are picking in. I'm like, oh god, he could have he could have a light light engine, and it doesn't really apply here. Okay, and let's just zoom in. I could also be like in the cockpit, although I, it feels weird with the FOV. It also seems to lag when I zoom in. Target destroyed. Form up on me. Roger. Roger, lead. Usually, if you want like the most kind of simulation kind of a thing, then you usually go into first person. Also, this game supports no widescreen whatsoever. So, uh, what are I don't really know what our objectives are right now. Um. Yeah. Well. Whatever. I can look at the ground, apparently. Or I can turn to the left. Ooh. Fancy. And I'm worried that one button is gonna, like, make the entire thing just blow up. Nav point beta reached. 
I'll figure it out. It looks like a, it looks like a decent game, and you know what? You can't. It was the MechWarrior Four games had really nice engines. It's one of the things I really liked about it is it was really solid, and I really liked the 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 kind of the the co teamwork stuff. Like it's a real shame like this didn't actually have any real co op. Like, uh, me and Ken looked into it and to, to see if we could do some uh, co-op play, but uh, there is no campaign co-op in this. You can, you can play co-op missions much to the same degree. Uh oh. Roger, Striker 3. Engage and destroy all enemy targets. Hey, Muscle Turret. Uh. Attack your nearest target. Roger. Copy. I'm just, I have ER large lasers, so I might as well use them for this. Destroyed. So we're trying to kill everything in, uh, encountered here. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, we have a shadow cat. That's like a good 40, 45 tons. It's pretty, uh, pretty difficult this early on. Attack my target. Roger. Roger. Fortunately, it's probably gonna be me holding the hand of the AI again. I remember how much trouble I had them getting to repair or anything. I don't know if there's a repair th area anywhere. Shadow cats, I don't th think are equipped with much. Oh wow! Look at that. Like his. Co we can just go try and cockpit his ass. Damn it! That was a terrible mess. I apologize. It's really difficult to get another shot in the cockpit. I'm just hoping that LRM splash damage will do it. Warning. Damage critical. Something's hitting me. I think it's this guy. I'm not. I'm not close enough for that. I think I have to be within uh, 800 meters. Oh boy, there is a lot of uh, targets here. And I didn't realize how much I was getting wrecked. I'm gonna turn my torso to the back. So hopefully he can't see me. And I'm still getting hit by something. Take out designated target. Copy. Copy. These guys are not being very helpful. Oh, uh, you know, let's try and get some LRMs out because, uh, as I said, I, you know, I, I, I expect this to be a sniper loadout, and I'm still just getting, like, butt wrecked. And he wasn't even looking at me, and he took a sh plot shot at me. What I'm hoping will happen is that my team is actually going to move up and try and kill him. How are they doing for, uh... Yeah, they're doing okay for damage, so... Probably should not use the, uh... R button here. This is why I kept it on regular, because I'm just... I'm not sure what to expect here, so I'm just like, well... You know? Maybe one day. No, their armor's weaker in the back, so maybe I'll just take a couple of pot shots off. Please don't turn around and see me. Please don't turn around and see me. I, I should really just keep it out in this view. Oh god, no, 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 don't do that. It's a terrible idea. You don't want to shoot me. And strangely, the music decides not to play and to play sometimes. I don't really understand why. I forget if the if the mech game before this did that. Oh, thanks a lot, useless teammates. Not very helpful there, guys. This is why I'm just gonna give them the biggest weapons and hope that they hit something with it occasionally. Well, let's go to Nav Gamma. And let's hope that there isn't... You know, I did see a lot of, like, targets here, so... You know, it's very possible we'll see something up here. Attack your closest target. Actually, you Roger. know what? Roger. Rendezvous with designated nav point. Roger. Copy. I'm gonna I'm gonna employ uh, a strategy called let my team go first. You know, they have the fastest mechs and they still get stuck on everything. This is why you give them the faster mechs. At least with assault it won't be as big of a difference. There you go, see? Draw their fire. And I hit the nav point reached, sir. Attack your closest target. Roger. Roger. And I hit something else. And they're still hitting me anyways. Target destroyed. Oh boy. Don't want to get hit by missile turrets. It looks like if I move though, it's really not a big problem. But they're not even hitting those things. 
Target destroyed. That was my first problem was I wasn't I wasn't moving around enough. Target destroyed. They're also not being very helpful. Target destroyed. Mandrel, this is Striker 1. All hostiles at Nav Gamma have been neutralized. Request infantry support to sweep mining complex and subterranean facilities. Roger, Striker 1. Infantry support is en route. Secure station until their arrival and report to TACCOM for mission debrief. Roger, Mandrel. Orders received. Striker 1, out. Good work, Striker Lance. Keep it up and we'll be off this rock in no time. Great work, Eric. We've given them something to fear. Oh, looks like there's no tasteful fate out there. All right, we got, uh, everyone's okay. Uh, no damage. Apparently gunnery and piloting skills are shit. At least we got a health spawn now. That's a good thing. Just a bit of a side note. At the end of every mission, I plan on cutting it out and just setting up for the next mission and uh, equipping all my mechs, and I'll show you each time what I'm doing, but just know that whenever I click the button, I'm probably editing it out. Okay, Lieutenant McClare. We've let them know we're here, and now we need to break their spirit. I'm taking Alpha Lance out on this next mission, and I need you to provide light support. You'll need to make a stealthy approach on the objective and engage from extreme distance. Ensure that your mech is equipped with at least one long-range weapon system. ECM would be helpful, but not required. Check in with the Quartermaster and get your mech outfitted. I'll see you in the field. Alright, so I'm running today uh, the Hellspawn 4, and uh, today I decided to equip uh, three medium lasers, two ultra AC, uh, AC2s, which is a long range weapon, so that will be fine, and an SRM6. So this is mostly a brawler mech, I decided to kind of make something with auto cannons, I figured that would be fun. Looks like it's only me, I don't get any lance mates, so, well that sucks. Oh, well, let's go. Okay, Striker 1, let's go over the op order one last time. You will proceed to Nav Alpha as directed by Mandrel, and take up a firing position on the pirate base. Destroy their local oxygen and water supply. When the base defenders move on your position, pull back to Nav Gamma, where Alpha Lance will be waiting, powered down in the crystals. Should be a straightforward ambush, and breaking their heavy lance should show these lousy pirates how outclassed they are. Roger that, sir. I got no problem being the bait for this little trap of yours. Just make sure you're ready to rock when I clear the ridge at Gamma. No worries, Lieutenant. I'm running short on wise-ass Lance Commanders, who would have a hell of a time replacing you. Black Six, out. So, uh... Vehicles are ready. I'm not really spec for long-range engagements here. Um, I have a little bit of long-range ability. Oh god. Maybe I- Oh, what the fuck? Hi, other hell spawn. Yo, let's just go to Nav Alpha and fuck these guys. Cause, uh... We don't have to put up with their bullshit. They will have to come to me. Also, what's my pelvis doing? Like, I have a pelvis in my mouth. point Alpha reached. Striker 1, this is Mandrel. From the top of the crater ridge at Alpha, you should be able to make out the fire base. The oxygen tank should be visible on the far left edge of the base. Destroying any tank should take them all out in the secondary explosions. To the right is their main H2O processor. Disabling it should put a severe cramp on their sustainability here. Alright, fine. Let's take that out. Excellent shot. The chain reaction has destroyed 80% of their O2 supply. Take out their water processor and get out of there. Uh, so now we gotta go in that beta. Let's go do that. Hope, uh, preferably not through their base. I just like how they're just like running after me right now. You know, the real only reason I'm running away is because I know that there's a they, they're describing a lance that's gonna power up, and I assume they're gonna have much better mechs than what, what I'm currently dealing with. All right, let's just make it to Nav Beta, and then we'll look around for it. I think it's somewhere Nav here. Nav Point Beta reached. Water processor. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. And that should handle that. Great work, Striker Lance. We read all targets destroyed. Ravenwing relays four mechs powering up and three more moving in from the east. 
Fall back by quickest route to Gamma. Alright, let's just get this bulldog. I can't aim when I'm like in whatever vision. I'm trying to head back to Gamma, truthfully. Oh god, I just ran one over. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, they're gonna they're gonna keep hurting me. But uh, we're just gonna go back to Nav Gamma. I mean, it's just over these ridges, so uh, that will give me some cover as I as I retreat. This is gonna be the best ambush I've ever seen. I mean, I feel like I feel like I'm in like the uh, the the bait lands or whatever. It's why there's only one of me right now. It's probably actually why they didn't bother having you with the AI. Fuck! I can't get up this hill. Hey, please ignore me. I'm retreating. Hopefully, these are gonna be some really badass mechs. And what do I see ahead of me? Oh, a shadow cat. Uh, this is not gonna be good. I'm currently not looking forward to this. But luckily, they all have to go around the same bridge that I just had trouble with, so. You know what? That's fine by me. Let's see if we can see the mechs that are shut down in the crystals. It's kind of a cool setup. It's just like an ambush. I want to. I want to see what what mechs we have, and if I'm severely disappointed, I'm gonna shoot one of them in the back and core them. Oh, here we go. Holy shit! So here we have uh, we have a mad cat, another mad cat, a third mad cat. I think it's what is this guy? That's a that's a damn that's a okay I don't even remember what it's called. Okay I'm sorry. Can I actually target him? No. So what are we supposed to do? I'm just getting supposed to dance here. Oh God please help me! I am a defenseless lone lines leader. Come to me. Black six to Alpha Lance. Let's take him out. So it's, there's Lawhorn. Wow. Nova Cat. That's right. That's what he's got. I, 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 don't, I don't really know my mech names to be honest. They have some really badass mechs to be honest. Like I don't know why I get that this shit like this like the Hell Spot. I'll give that to the fucking Mike Lat Lance. Jeez. The guy's a scrub. We're in the scrub lands, but that's okay. I think I made a good call though, in uh, in taking uh, in just running away out of, away from these guys. To be honest, I don't think I'm gonna be doing much auto cannons or missiles for that matter. Something that locks on at close range. There's luckily in the MechWarrior universe, there's plenty of options for me because I can't seem to hit these guys even if my life depended upon it. Well, it's kind of fun watching them in action. I mean, they're better than my lance mates. Just please die. Shadow Cat, why are you invincible? Target destroyed. Thank you. Wow, these these guys are useless. Too. Like, I really should not be in danger right now. Like, oh god, a Thor. Yeah, he's got some ultra something and some lasers and shit so uh hey uh sergeant anders you want to save my ass here target destroyed good job guys good work striker one remind me back at base to work out a lance upgrade for you roger there is this new nova cat i noticed in the latest quartermaster report <laughs> Something in the medium range should suffice for now. Tactical command shows zero hostiles on scope. Remaining pirates have evacuated to the east. Alpha and Striker Lances return to base heading 285. What a dick. And also I want I want a Dashi, I don't want a fucking Nova Cat. Anyways, uh, so here we go. We got Shimra, Shadow Cat, and uh, Shamira, sorry, I don't, I don't know, and Uziel, and some neat, neat actually weapons, so ERPPC, so we get a bit of good sniping action coming up next, so until then, I'll see you later, bye.